All right, guys, what is up? It is uh, yours truly, Bosnian Cheese, back to fuck the party up. You know how it is. We're uh, we're here. I can't really run right now. I'm just kind of walking, just trying to get somewhere. I'm trying to leave the museum right now. Yeah, some some shit really went down last episode. Uh, Jade, you know, we had to put it out of her misery. It was a very sad moment, but... Yeah, it sucked, because now this guy's never going to get laid. That was, like, the only attractive woman in this whole this whole uh, city. This whole zombie-infested city. He's going to have to have sex with zombies or something. Just to get his nut. Alright, uh, now we can run, so... Let's go take your stuff from the back. Oh, I got my stuff back. Oh, it's these fucks. What the hell are they? <laughs> I feel like he didn't even know I was coming. Damn, that is so gruesome. Oh, nice. Can I just, uh, take all items? Wait, what is this? Can I... Alright. Now we have all our stuff back, and, uh, <clears throat> we're gonna go, hopefully, get our, our payback from this asshole who's, who's screwed us way too many times. Oh, man, we gotta do this all again? Wait, that's a pretty good weapon. Tahir's weapon. Damn. Um, Alright, and uh, I just actually recently realized the military rifle is actually fully automatic, while the police rifle is not, so... I mean, that's uh, <clears throat> that's the difference. I thought the I didn't realize why the firepower difference was so huge, but I think I still like the police rifle better, just because, um, you know, your ammo's a problem in this, and you can just keep your ammo... Uh, you know, you can conserve your ammo a little bit better. That's always a big deal in the zombie apocalypse. You know how that is, but I do want to try out the military rifle at some point, because that sounds pretty cool. Fully automatic mowing down zombies. Oh, I have the bow, too. I remember this. Oh, nice. All right. Oh, that's that. Oh, I don't have ammo. Um, do I have ammo for the bow, though? Nice. All right, let's get out of this museum. This is the craziest looking museum I've ever seen. That is a castle, that's not even a museum. Alright, <clears throat> let's go to Sector Zero. Jade and I are both infected, and Rice made us fight for Antizin. She... She let me have it. Sacrificed her life for me. And when she turned, I... I had to put her out of her misery. First Raheem, now Jade. I swear I'm gonna fucking make Rice pay. <laughs> he said that last part really quick. I swear I'm gonna fucking make Rice pay. Alright, um... Yeah, that is a castle. Not Dr. a museum Cameron, at all. Crane, do you copy? Great. Good to hear you're still alive. Did you find Jake? Yeah, yeah, I, I found her. Listen, I also found Dr. Zara's tissue samples. And I'll bring them to you, but... But first, there's something else I need to do. I know, Doc, but I'm about to buy us time. I'll be in touch. Ooh, this is fun. <laughs> mm. Like, never has a zombie game been as just, like, fun. Just straight up fun as this game since, like, like, uh, Dead Rising or Left 4 Dead. Those are, like, the top two just have fun killing zombies. And that is this game as well. Alright, now we're gonna meet with Troy. Uh, I'm not really sure why, but... Probably has something to do with trying to kill Rise. Because he is an asshole who really is just fucking up my life, you know? Like, this place could be nice, you know? If everyone worked together and just killed zombies and stuff, it could be a nice spot. But Rise has gotta go and ruin everything. Oh, I think I could pull arrows from him while they're still in him. Damn, this dude can take some shots. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, give my arrows back. I put a lot of arrows into that guy. Damn. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's one of these dudes. Oh, headshot. I don't even know if that's... He has, like, armor. I don't know if that really went into him. Oh, dude, back up. Let me take care of this. Uh-oh. If that guy dies, I'm leaving. I'm trying to save his life, and he's just fucking it all up. 
Oh, he died, huh? I'm an idiot. Yeah, I don't need to kill a zombie. But I do hate those guys. Fuck those guys. I think I'm gonna try to kill this guy. Just, just see if I can with his bow. Boom. Headshot. This is gonna take a lot of attempts, I think. You know, I'm slowly starting to think, is this worth it? Oh, wait. Oh, I don't have ammo. That would have been sweet. Just gun him down with the military rifle. Oh! Oh, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Alright, we're out, we're out. We don't gotta kill that guy. <laughs> he can chill, you know, he can do his thing. We'll just... We'll go do our thing. We've got... We have humans to worry about. We don't gotta be worrying about zombies, you know? That one. That outfit. Get out of here. I'm talking about zombies' clothing. Alright, let's keep moving. This is a nice plaza spot. All the big open air. Oh, wait. They're fighting. How did they even get there? Why are they even fighting that? Like, if you saw that and you were with, like, one of your friends and you both had swords and that was it. Even if you had guns, I wouldn't even shoot at that thing. That's terrifying. And then it obviously killed them because how would it not? Whew. All right. Let's keep moving here. Uh, I'm actually really, uh, I'm kind of sad right now. Me and Yixlar have just finished up our Resident Evil Mercenaries walkthrough. And, uh, it was a great time. You know, that was definitely one of my favorite things to record on this channel so far. And, uh, yeah, we just finished it off just, um, a little bit ago, like 20 minutes ago. And I'm sad about it. But that's okay, because we got more stuff coming. I'm really excited for you guys to see what we have coming up next. Can't tell you about it. Can't tell you about it yet, but you will see eventually. Okay, how do I get up here? Can I just... Yeah, I think this is the way. Can I... Oh, do we go inside? Right, go down, go down. Yeah, I think we gotta climb inside of it. Or not. I mean, it's not gonna let me. Okay, okay, this is weird. Oh, no, over here, maybe? Okay, I'm having trouble right now. Oh, God, that scared me. That was so loud. Such a loud scream. I was not expecting that. Okay, I think we just need to climb in here. I don't know how to climb in here, though. I'm pretty sure there's, like, a button for this. Give me a second, guy. Oh, there we go. There we go. You just have to look a certain direction. Um. Now what? That's step one. And apparently, it's the last step as well. Because there's nowhere to go from here. here maybe uh, nope nope let's go this way yeah yeah there we go Whew. all right let's keep it uh let's keep it moving just climbing step why is there a laptop here <laughs> I think someone was jerking off like, and playing checkers at the same time that's hot Oh, what is this? I thought I was supposed to talk to this guy. Exploding arrows? Oh, man. That sounds kind of worth it. That's a $1,000, and I only have 4000 Ooh, that sounds kind of worth it. Actually, let me sell some stuff. I have a lot of things to sell. Um, don't need that. Don't need that. Um, yeah, don't need that or that. Right. Yeah, I'm going to get a couple of these exploding arrows. Just a couple. Just see. Let's get some rifle ammo too. Pistol ammo. Let's get some arrows. Let's um, sell all my valuables. I got a lot of valuables. Oh yeah, now I get ten thousand bucks. That's cool. All right. Can we keep going up or? Oh, looks like nothing around here. Oh, out here. There we go. Finally. 
I feel like I'm a little rusty at this game. Every time I play this, just don't. Haven't played for a while. So, what do I have to do? You need to install it at the highest place possible. That way, we'll have the best chance to break through. Okay, so let me guess. I need to head out to that giant antenna tower at the edge of town. The fastest way is through the sewers. Savvy will guide you over the radio. So contact him when you get to the other side. And Crane, when you install the amp, make sure to set the correct frequency on your radio. Pull this off, and the entire world will hear you. Let's hope so. See you, Troy. <clears throat> Alright, now we're going to use the sewer tunnels to reach the radio tower. That should be fun. I feel like there's a lot of running through the sewers in this game. It's kind of like a, a trademark, if you will, of the game. Oh, <laughs> I thought I was going to die there. Well, I, when I first jumped, I thought I was going to make it. And then after that, when I realized I wasn't going to make it, I thought I was going to die. All right. Let's keep going. <clears throat> Uh, you guys might have noticed, uh, I sound a little sick right now, or maybe I do in every single one of my videos, because, uh, what you guys might not know is I'm allergic to cats, and, uh, we always record at a house that has two cats, so I don't know if you guys have ever heard me without a slightly stuffy nose, or slightly, or just a small cough, I think that's, like, all you guys have ever heard me with, but I swear I don't always sound just, like, like, sniffling and, uh, coughing. It's just the cats, I swear. But I'm only allergic to some cats. Other cats, no. But Yuxlarb's cats, yes. But Yuxlarb's cats at home, no. But his cats here, yes. Ooh. That's just so unsafe. Like, people throw away so many sharp, hard objects. Oh, I have unspent skill points. Oh, two, actually. How did I not notice this? Let's see what we got. We can make a shield. <laughs> oh, grappling hug, yes. <laughs> it's time guys it's time you can pick the reward from your stash at any safe house or get it from the quartermaster oh yes guys you realize what this means this this is gonna change the whole game trust me wait more stamina huh huh hmm let me see stun kill a meat instantly kill stunned enemies yeah, I feel like I should have that already. There we go. I feel like that's a little overdue. Oh, next time I get that grappling hook. Huh, that's going to be a good one. That's going to be good. Just wait, guys. You'll probably see that in the next episode. Oh, I'm in a bathroom. I thought that was the way in. I just ran straight up. Is it this way? No, it's another bathroom. What are you doing? Get out of here. Stop following me. Fucking zombies. Am I supposed to go through here? Is this even the right place? I don't think it is. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, maybe it is. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> okay. Nah, I don't need that. I don't need that. I need to go down here. Oh, this is getting spooky. Ooh, spooky dead bodies. Scary. Enter these sewers. We need to make sure the signal is strong enough to get past the jamming. Installing the amplifier on the tallest antenna tower in Haran should do the trick. Hopefully. Savvy says the safest way there is through the sewers. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, uh, this looks like it's gonna be, uh... Another one of those missions through the sewers. One of those, uh... Adventures, and I hope you guys are ready to go on this adventure with me in the next episode because we're stopping right here So <laughs> thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you next time for this underground path